creative, your brain lies. How do I know it lies? Because you always X or you never Y. Because it keeps setting standards that you can't possibly, possibly reach. And even if you do reach a goalpost, your brain goes and moves it. Listen, all artist brains lie. I don't know why they do this. They call it imposter syndrome. They give it all kinds of titles. But the fact is that your brain will produce nonsense. You can look at something that you ever find that is legitimately beautiful, that moves people to tears, and all you see are the flaws. Stupid brain. So listen, how do you know that it's a lie and not actual helpful criticism? That's the point. Helpful. Something specific like that character arc didn't land, that gives you something to do. You say, all right, I'm going to study how character arcs work. I'm going to dig into this particular character's backstory and see why it didn't give me the payoff I wanted. That's actionable. That's specific. That's not you suck at characters and you never write good ones. If your brain gives you actionable things, you know it's genuine. If it gives you something that's vague, distance, and can't even be pinned down or defined, that's no good. You always, you never, those are lies. Start trying to fight those lies this week, creative. I don't know a way to shut them off. There is no off button, but you don't have to let them take root either. You can do this. Keep growing, keep learning, don't stop. Now sit down with me, my fellow creatives, and let's make something new.